It's about um, entities interacting uh, while they are striving to different goals, okay? When I was a kid, we didn't have a lot of money. I have one brother, may he live long, and uh, we didn't have a lot of money in the family. Once in a while, there was a piece of cake available or a piece of candy or chocolate or something like that for the two children. And my mother would divide it into two parts and give my brother one part and me. He's, he's four years older than me. Good. Well, it sounds good, but it's not good because... Uh, Invariably, there was dissatisfaction, crying. One of the children would say, it's unfair. I got the smaller piece. My brother got the larger piece. It's not fair. So my mother got tired of this. Okay. And, uh, you know, what was supposed to be a treat turned out to be... Uh, dissatisfaction. And what she did was something very smart. She would give the piece to one of us, the whole piece of chocolate, and she would say to, let's say she gives it to me, and she says, yes, I'll, you divide it into two parts, okay? You divide it into two parts. But then let Moshe take one of the parts, choose one of the parts. So that was the end of the crying. Why was it the end of the crying? It was the end of the crying because suddenly Moshe could not complain because he chose. But I could not complain either because if I said Moshe took the larger part, my mother would say, why didn't you divide equally? <laughs> so I had no grant. So the, the crying stopped. So my mother was a game theorist. What was she doing? She was uh, promoting her interests, which was to have uh, the kids satisfied and happy. And she was using our, our incentives. Our, she was using the fact that we promote our interests to... Uh, to uh, to get done what she wanted done, yeah. So she she was taking advantage of our incentives, of the, the fact that we are promoting our interests. And that's what all of game theory does. Okay, practical example.